And he's a gem. A black teenager from Syracuse danced his way to Boston for a five week intensive program at one of the top ballet schools in the country. Our Callahan Marshall went to one of his last practices before he left to see how he even got there. Come on. You can feel the love when he turns, points his feet, and stretches his arms. 13 year old Nathaniel Taylor has been perfecting his ballet for six years. I feel that I'm letting out the energy that, say, if I'm mad, I'm letting that out through dance. And this passion led him to an experience of a lifetime. For the next five weeks, he'll be at one of the most prestigious dance schools in the country, Boston Ballet. But getting in was a fight. I was hard because they paired me up with older people so but I kept up here look at the post and he broke barriers what I find very unique about it is really actually being from Syracuse and getting into the school as a young man and then as a young black man from um, a, a young you know man from Syracuse specifically because um, you, the opportunities for girls are readily available to where these opportunities aren't you know, readily available for young men. But the practice space, wherever it may be, makes him forget about all that. When you enter a ballet studio, there's nothing to overcome. You know, once you're here, once you submit to the art, this is like you're in the studio. This has been his safe space. He'll be learning much more than a new adagio routine. This is like going to give him an idea of what it's like to be a professional, to be away from home, to do his own laundry, and uh, to do a lot of independence, a level of independence. Uh, ballet, um, ballet students have a tendency to mature, you know, sooner. Defeating the odds, one tour at a time. Well, we're going to have to do that. Awesome stuff. Taylor will be practicing about 30 hours a week. It's like full-time job.